Now, the Philippines' top broadcaster, ABS-CBN, has been ordered to cease operations immediately. Authorities say its license has expired. ABS-CBN is regularly criticized by President Rodrigo Duterte. The broadcaster has released a statement saying if it closes, millions of Filipinos will lose their source of critical and timely information, especially during the pandemic. Buena Bernal explains. If this can happen to ABS-CBN, this can happen to other television networks with even smaller market share. You have to understand that ABS-CBN is the Philippines' largest entertainment and media company in terms of revenue, income, assets, and number of employees. There are political underpinnings here. In a Senate hearing last uh, February, ABS-CBN CEO Carlo Katikbak actually apologized to Philippines President Rodrigo Duterte who has been a staunch critic of the TV network saying that some of his campaign ads were not aired during the 2016 election. Now, another issue being discussed here is actually that NTC previously committed before Congress to grant provisional authority to ABS-CBN to continue to operate um, beyond uh, the original franchise that expired on May 4. And that is because Congress is still deliberating on the uh, renewal of its franchise.